Hello, how y'all doing again? This is Kay. I had to let y'all see me this time. <laughs> I just got through cooking and I made me something quick. Some onions, um, potatoes, and turkey sausage. Let me get a little plate. How y'all doing? Okay. I'm gonna move that over a little bit. Now this gonna be probably hot. I'm gonna have to move it. Mm -hmm. Here we go. How y'all doing? Ooh, look at this thing. Ooh, where am I putting it? Well, I got my cart right here, so let's. So now nah, we can't put it right there. We're gonna have to put it right here. For right now. So what I did was saute me some potatoes and onions. I cut up some whole garlic. I'm just gonna get a little bit. Mm. A little bit right there. And I took and fried the sausages, the sausages separate. I split them down the middle and fried them. Then added them to the potatoes, onions, and the green peppers. I seasoned it with some turmeric. I was watching um, Swoop, and she was like, you can put turmeric on anything. So I was in her live today. Shout out to Miss Swoop for that wonderful idea, and I got turmeric, but I don't ever use it. So I said, I'm going to use it today. So let's rearrange this. Y'all know I ain't never. <laughs> but I'm feeling better, though. I'm feeling a lot better. I'm just getting ready to get out. I'm ready to get out. So it's time for me to go to work in the morning. So let me just slide this over this way. Because I want y'all to be able to see what I'm eating. Ta-da! Just don't pay the towel no attention. Okay. So we're going to see how it tastes. We're going to get our grace in. God is great. God is good. God is good. for this food. God is we all our feet. That's what I daily bread. I mean. So we got garlic and onions. I didn't put no salt. I did use uh, turmeric, garlic, and season on, and black pepper. I bring yeah. So I'm going to let y'all get a taste of the potato. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, baby, that's it. No salt. Okay, now let's taste the sausage. And I fried them first and then let them saute on the potatoes. Mm-hmm. Mm. That's somebody on Facebook. Well, I hope y'all having an amazing day. The sun going out. It's coming out, then it go back in. It's coming out, then it go back in. It's just a rainy day. Mm. Y'all, this melt in your mouth. And not in your hand, honey. Mm. 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 Now, let me see. Let me read something. Let's take it right over here. And watch me a good movie. Y'all, I don't know how I'm going to sit up. I got to sit up. We're going to have to go ahead and get my couch in here. Or I'm going to have to go and buy more. Seriously. Because that bed ain't good to be in it all day. Okay. Now let's get Now, I did the daily bread, remember? That came out of Jeremiah 29 and 11, or did it? Yeah. Remember the marvelous works that he has done. Hmm. Okay. Um, I am fairly patriotic toward America most of the time. There's a famous song called This Land is Your Land by Woody most Americans probably know some of the words to this song. Yes, we all do. It's mentioned 
mention some of the important landmarks and aspects of America, California to New York, to Redwood, forest and the Gulf Stream waters, yep. And at the end of most of the verses, he's saying this land was made for you and me. The end of the song, however, takes a darker turn. No trespassing signs, he mentions. The relief office, he mentions. Hunger, people. Then he asks, is this land made for you and me? Few Americans know the end of this song, and what most to consider as a patriotic and welcoming tune has some dark questions at the end. The poem that David commands his associates to use to praise God is more welcoming. God's the, God does not consider where you are from, who you are, how much money you make, or what color your skin is. He is the creator of heaven and earth. He is the judger of all things. All people should seek him and rejoice in his name. The seas, the fields, the trees, and people all sing his praises. There is no division, no dark questions, only positivity and love. Blessed to be the Lord God of Israel forever and ever. Amen. Okay, now let me see. Let's go big. You say, this land is your land. This land is my land. From California to the you know, to the New York song. Mm, Y'all remember that song? Oh, I got to sneeze. Uh oh. <coughs> Real life. I ain't. I, I. I don't know how to edit, and I ain't gonna take it out. Excuse me. I told you. But y'all, ooh, my nose sore. Let's get the sore. Okay. 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 But yeah. But no trespassing signs. He mentions that I should play that song. Because I don't know how it ends. All I remember is this land was made for you and me. I don't remember the dark side to the song. But I'm going to have to look it up. So I hope y'all enjoyed today's reading. And blessed be the Lord God of Israel forever and ever. Amen. Now, somebody else was discussing something, y'all. I'm going to have to go live on this one. So let me go ahead and get my phone charged up. Now, some people were saying that just because Israel is at war, that don't mean the world is coming to an end. I don't think it means that the world may be coming to an end just because of that war, but I believe that's a prophetic word and a prophetic warning that we are getting close to the end of times. So we're going we're gonna to do a little bit more research on it. But I, I believe that this just is a sign that the end of times are, they're here most definitely. We living in our last days. Yeah, I'm, I don't got hot. I can eat this because I put turmeric and black pepper in. I think it's going to make me hot. Anyway, so yeah, I'm going to be going live. You can believe that. I'm going to try anyway, y'all. With all this going on, network and stuff, so I'm going to try. Now I'm going to stick here. This is good. I could have used some salt, but I didn't want to put no salt. Wait a minute now. Oh, that's an onion. I was like, what's that? <laughs> Don't trust the whole cooking. Okay, y'all. We got some discussing to get into. I need to look up some stuff. So I'm going to see y'all on the next one. I enjoyed it. It's just that I had to take it slow. The last 48 hours was a little rough for Miss K. It really was. So I better take it real slow. And I'll see y'all on the next one, hun. Peace. Whoosh.